TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here, host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, and we are looking at the Dow up 166. Finally, the Dow had a little bit of uh, leverage from yesterday's pullback. That initial th up thrust that went from the 25,252 level uh, just a few days ago, spirals up and then it stalls. Now there's a green candle. That's very important. Whether it holds or not is going to be dependent on the close today, I mean, holds this week, depends on the close today. We're up 157, just gave back a little bit. If the Dow is only up about 110 by the end of the day, that suggests we're going to stall for a little while. I am impressed with the weekly chart. I've said that for a long time. It held the 14 period exponential moving average exactly, ran higher. I'm going to be watching this very closely. There's a chance that a chunk of this move to the downside has been done and that we might have to do a little bit more retesting. That's what I'm looking at, and let me explain why. If you look at the SPY, which is the S&P uh, 500, the S&P itself is up 24 at 28.15. So you're at 281.84. It's just made a new recovery high above that PD. I'm calling this a V-shaped pattern, and just for argument's sake, don't want to, I don't want to change anything that I've got you other than to put in an E rather than an A, and that has extended the weekly chart to leg B continuing. Here's the big issue. Three days ago, <clears throat> the Qs had a really good rally, much better than the other indices. Yesterday, made a new recovery high. Today, it's ex extended that, and here again, I'm calling this an E. It has a characteristic that it could become a new buy mode. I'm not going to argue with that. That weekly chart has been very strong. IWM has not been as strong, but it is still pretty good today. It's at 1.17 and 155.54, way underneath. And the reason why I'm looking at this as a small guest board of different indices to give me a bigger picture is it's individual uh, indexes that are doing different things. The uh, Qs are leading all of a sudden. You've got the Dow following, and then you've got the, the SPY. Sorry, the SPY following. The Dow hasn't made a new recovery high. And the IWM is lagging. So, yeah, you've got your four indices, not in lockstep, but we're going to watch it closely. Gold had a good rally today. We'll talk about this when we get back for my show, the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming right up after this break. Stay tuned. Thousand Chapman signing off. Otherwise, I'll see you in a moment. Otherwise, it's tomorrow. <laughs>